guys. This is Andrew from Androidica.com, and we're taking a look at Opera for tablets. I'm sure plenty of you have seen this on your Android phone. Now they have a, another version optimized for your Zoom and your Galaxy Tab 10.1, so they're going to explain it to us right now. Yeah, so this is uh, Opera Mobile 11. Uh, we've released two new versions today, Opera Mini 6 and Opera Mobile 11. Opera Mobile 11 is our full uh, client-side browser, so all the rendering is done on the client itself, like the, uh, the native browser on the device. And if you download it on the tablet device, you'll automatically get the tablet optimized UI. As you can see down here, you have the speed dials, which you can synchronize with your, your mobile phone or your desktop browser using Opera Link. Um, and then obviously, you know, uh, it has sort of the same features as your mobile phone version, but they're all up here in this now, this top bar. So here we have the visual tabs. Uh, one of the major things requested from, from Opera Mobile was a better integration to the platform, so it made it a lot smoother. We now have we now have pinned zoom, and we have we put a lot of work into performance, so you don't get any checkerboarding when you're scrolling. Um, you know, and you can. It's really fast and really smooth to use. Another thing, obviously, we brought a lot of functionality down from our desktop browser. So this is our score on HTML5 test. It's, it's currently the highest of any mobile browser. Um, uh, at the same time, we've integrated into the share network, so you can share for any uh, application that registers on your, on your Android device to share from. Uh, so that's, uh, that's Opera Mobile 11. If I go back and I can show you Opera Mini 6. Again, this is a, uh, you get the same UI, the tablet UI, but this is Opera Mini, and Opera Mini is our client server browser. So when you load a web page in Opera Mini, it'll go off to our servers, which will download the web page. It'll then compress it to a, a smaller format and send it back. So basically you get, uh, so basically, you'll get uh, a, a, lot of, a lot of data savings. It'll compress web pages up to 90%. Um, at the same time, it'll be a lot faster than a native browser. So if you're on roaming abroad or if you're on a slow network, then definitely Opera Mini is the one to choose. Uh, you mentioned that it, it compresses, so it does save you time and, and speed, yeah. but does it sacrifice like quality like it, among images or anything so, like that? So yeah, a lot of our compression... Uh, let me just... Uh, Load up a web page here. A lot of our compression saving comes from uh, it comes from a couple of different things, but a lot of it comes from uh, you know we downgrade the image quality slightly. At the end, the same time we block flash elements, so you don't get all the adverts. You have to download all the flash elements in the background, but you still get a full desktop-like experience when browsing these web pages. Uh, what if what if there's something uh, a flash content that you do want to see? Does it support that anyway? So Opera Mini does not support that on Opera Mobile. We we integrate into the Flash plugin. And, okay. and it's it's a, it's an on-demand system, so uh, you'll be presented with a box uh, where the flash elements are, and you click them to play them. So you don't have okay. to load you don't have to load uh, you know all of the adverts on a web page, just the YouTube video you want. But at the okay. same time, like Opera Mini now, we've integrated in. We have Pin Zoom, which is one of the most requested things. So you have the same UI as Opera Mobile and share functionality. So as you can see, it still looks like the desktop page. You know, it still has good quality, but you're getting compression savings and speed benefits at the same time. Uh, now, is, is this going to be available directly to cons consumers, or is it yeah. partner with OEMs? It's, uh, no, it's uh, free to download from the Android Marketplace today, as of today. So. Okay, so you guys can run over to the Android Market and install Opera Mini or Opera Mobile to your 